morning. Good morning, Ed. Morning. Morning, Smurf. Morning, nature. It's amazing sunlight again this morning. It's just so. It's that thing I was talking about yesterday. Magnetics. Oh, the Schumann resonance. <coughs> this is interesting. I'll show you the picture when we get home. The Schumann resonance is back after nearly a whole week. So it disappeared on, I think it was late Friday. And it's been like a blackout. So I've kind of been putting the theory about maybe the magnetics from the sun have been so strong that it's just it can't pick up the reading it's like maxed out the, the, the equipment I think that's what's happened that's what I'm kind of feeling if you like um, so it's back today and the shape and this is weird yeah they posted an image of what was going on over these past few days. I think that's what the picture is. When you zoom in, I can't quite see the numbers. But when you look at it, it does this in. It's a wave, but in those waves are three pyramids. Because normally a wave is curved, isn't it? The wave curves but this is actually three pyramids you can see very clearly three pyramid shapes in the waveform <laughs> pyramid energy so we're getting this pyramid at exactly the right time there's a um he's uh, one of the uh tuning fork sellers on ebay sells copper pyramids they do do the really big ones, but we don't have the space for that, so we're getting one of the smaller ones. Um, yeah, made from copper, because we know that copper is an amazing transmitter, transmuter, conductor of energy. We've actually got copper around our bed as well, around our mattress. And we sleep on amber and mustard seed mattress as well. So amber is highly, uh, is it piezoelectric? Yeah. Piezoelectric, yeah. That's the word I was looking for. There's a plane up there, I think it's a plane. Yeah, that's a plane. That's a plane. So, get an eye on the sky, keep, uh, keep your eyes on the sky, people. Because we have seen some stuff. Even before this was going on, we've seen stuff. Yeah, so um, the Schumann Resonance is back. Not that it wasn't there, but yeah, they can, they're redetecting it now. But yeah, very interesting picture that they posted of this mad waveform with very clear pyramid shapes in there. I'm like, whoa, if that's not a message, <laughs> then I don't know what is. So maybe the pyramids themselves have been reactivated with this, you know, change in the, the light. What do you think, Ian? Um, well, you said it, so it, it's up. Okay. Because that's how it works, isn't it? There's a, there's a signal going about the planet. Yeah. People were saying it. Yeah. Then it must be a thing, doesn't it? Yeah, because we know that they're not burial chambers. We know that they're resonance chambers. That's a given. The whole well, burial. There's no evidence to say that they are. And the majority of the evidence is to say that they, you know, that they are. Uh, <coughs> Sorry, there's very little evidence to say that they're not, brother. And uh, there's overwhelming evidence to, to say, to say they are pyramids. Mm. They didn't find copies in the province. They've done experiments in them to 
Yeah, with sail. Uh, the frequency. Yeah. They think it's there is a uh, underneath them or water is water, which yeah. would be the conductor. Yeah, huge amplifier. Um, and lots of other stuff as well. I mean, the whole spiritual side of it. The whole idea of I was reading something yesterday about uh, you know, the pharaohs going in and sending themselves uh, into space, not physically, but telepathically. Yeah. With, with either a bit like. Um, a bit like a uh, mork. Mork hog calling also. <laughs> yeah. It's yeah. a bit like that. Because um, it's a way of communicating. If you understand how your brain works, in yeah. a way of communicating to the outer reaches of where you need to go, if you're talking to your where you've come from. It's nice to enjoy the grass. Is that fun? Oh, it's lovely. It's like a... It's like a it's like a lovely bath, darling. <laughs> oh, Smurf, we love you, mate. <laughs> well, if he is, he can have a bath later, can't he? We'll have a lovely shower when we get home. Do you need a drink? No? Okay. No, Mummy, I just need to roll in my spa. It's lovely. <laughs> oh, Smurfers. He's a lovely boy. Oh, you get to roll without your harness on. Oh, he loves rolling in the grass. Daddy, I love it. I love it. Thank you, Daddy. There's that staffy gob. Morning, pheasant. Is that fun? <laughs> oh, lovely boy. Mmm, yeah, mmm. Here we go. <laughs> oh, hello. Bit naked without his uh, harness. A bit naked, Smurf. I don't care. I just love rolling. <laughs> He's so happy. Oh, happy dog! You couldn't do that when there was snow here, could you now? Boy. Just listen to that, it's amazing, isn't it? Beautiful. Happy dog. Be careful. <laughs> Good boy. Look at that big gob. 
Tja. Naked boys, all naked outside. <gasps> Good boy. You got a lovely breakfast when we get home. Oh, bless him. He's so cute, Smurf. Right. We're going to sign off. Have an amazing Woden day. Day Woden. Woden. Amazing day, even though Mercury is in retrograde. Um, so actually, I, I as you say, today is a good day to sleep. Because <laughs> um, a lot of people are reporting those kind of symptoms at the moment. You know, sleeping, quite tired. But you know, we're going through a major shift, so you know, be good to yourself. Be gentle with yourself. Sleep if you need to. Yeah? A bit of self care. Snuggle up with your woofy <laughs> and have a kip. Okay, I'm going to get on with our walk. And uh, I say be fearless and stay witchy.